Hey there, nerdos! Welcome to 4 Nerds by Nerds Reviews. Today, we'll be taking a look at a game called Tadpole Tales. It is the newest free-to-play game on Steam. It is a 2D hand-drawn shoot-em-up game published by Pinnacle Studios. This game brings back nostalgic elements with a 2D art style where you play as a tiny tadpole cleaning up rivers and fighting pollution. This epic journey challenges you to make your way down river where you will encounter Enemies, which are regular river creatures that have been covered in pollution. Once you clean them off, they will turn back into their happy normal selves. This little tadpole is full of courage and spunk as he blasts away the pollution that plagues the river. Along this journey, you will take three different forms. You can level up from your standard tadpole form to grow legs and become faster and more powerful as you collect hearts through the river. Size does matter when it comes to speeding up your life cycle into a frog. The first form will get you by with a small hitbox, while the second advanced form is great for speed and power compared to the final form that trades all of your speed for absolute power when you become a giant frog. As you get hit by enemies, you will transform down in stages back to your normal self if you get hit enough times. Tadpole Tail does not take itself very seriously though. The hand-drawn art style is excellent for those who enjoy playing games like Cuphead. Don't expect the same difficulty. Tadpole Tales is its own game and makes that clear with its soft nature. Along the way, you will face off against three main bosses that have their challenges. There are no checkpoints, so expect to learn with trial and error while trying to beat the game with this one credit life system. The old school game mechanics of side scrolling and movement doesn't work for some games, but Tadpole Tales are short and right to the point, so it helps you stay engaged on what you will face ahead on the screen, but some might find it a pain. The game has several enemy types with their own abilities to keep you guessing. Some types shoot projectiles faster or slower, while others set obstacles along the way. These different mechanics of the game forces the player to adapt and keep a steady flow going while they paddle downstream. Along with a point system, the game also has a scoreboard to track your score, compete with others, and race your friends to see who can clean the river the fastest. The gameplay is a plodding pace, so don't expect to get hours out of it, but instead, you can admire the art and care the developers put into the game. I'm happy to say this game has no bugs that we could find currently, which is exciting because so many games get rushed and have issues at launch. It's nice to see what a small team can do, and I look forward to seeing the other projects they will be releasing. As we said, Tablet Tales is free and available on Steam right now. We're giving Tadpole Tales a 9 out of 10. Thank you guys for checking out this review. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. Stay nerdy, my friends.